Welcome to Saving History. I'm SC Digger, and today I want to take just a couple of minutes to show you how we set up our Technetics T2 uh, for relic hunting. Now, I use the T2 SC, Rush uses the uh, regular T2, and the setup is pretty much the same with uh, just a minor difference. Okay, so here's how we set up our T2s for relic hunting, and certainly want to emphasize that this is not necessarily the only way to do it. Uh, certainly you got to find what you're comfortable with and what works for you but this works what works for us here down in uh, down the low country and in, in good ground so the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna turn the machine on and let it cycle through okay so first thing uh, first thing that's gonna happen here we see our menu so we're gonna go to sensitivity and you want to of course run that sensitivity uh, sensitivity up as high as you can uh, usually keep it right around 80 is where we tend to use it tends to be most stable uh, then down to disc level what we're going to do on the disc level is we're going to run that sucker all the way down to zero um, basically it's 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 not all metal but it's 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 no discrimination so you're going to hear a lot of stuff but you're also going to maximize your depth now the difference here uh, between the T2 and the T2 SE comes right here with a number of tones um, Ross with his T2 he runs a uh, number of tones with the with the two tones two plus uh, what I do since this is the SE version is I take that thing all the way up to the boost mode so I, know I go all the way to the right and I back up one DP shows up and that shows me I'm in the boost mode now go back to the the top of the menu and the next thing I've got to do is I simply got to ground balance so by pushing this toggle switch forward and pumping the machine up and down I get a good ground balance right there at 43 and we're ready to relic hunt okay so that's how we set up the Technetics T2 for relic hunting down here in the low country this is good ground of course uh, yours might slightly differ based on where you are and the type of hunting you're doing uh, and as I said this is not necessarily the best way to do it uh, you may have your own uh, a way that you are comfortable with and feel like you're maximizing your machine and I certainly encourage you to uh, post suggestions below uh, in the comments if you've got anything to add to uh, the way you set up your T2 uh, but for saving history I'm Edwin Digger <laughs>